my name is Jess and welcome to my channel. Okay guys, so for today's video, I'm really excited because I'm gonna be sharing with you a few DIYs that I made for my bathroom. I made these DIYs using neutral colors and always adding some greenery um, because I really like how that green pops out in my projects and in my house and in my home decor so I hope that you like it and these are going to be using things from Dollar Tree things that I already had at home that you can get maybe from Walmart for only 97 cents or things that you can maybe get on a thrift store if you don't have one of these materials it's okay you don't need to go and buy anything try to use things that you have at home and create your own DIY decor hope that this video helps you and inspires you and if you like it please give me a big thumbs up that really helps to support my channel and make sure that you are subscribed and that you hit the bell and guys thank you so much for all the people that are subscribed to my channel we are already more than 41,000 subscribers and that makes me feel so happy and so blessed so thank you so much and remember to follow me on my social media pages I have Instagram Pinterest Facebook and my web page diybyjazz.com all the links are going to be in the description box of this video and that's it let's get started with today's DIY Okay guys, so for the first project, I'm going to be using this circle wooden plaque that I get from Walmart for only 97 cents. Or you can use any other sign that you have at home, no matter if it's in wood or what shape it has, anything is going to work well. And the first thing I did was to remove the staple and the sticker it had. From there, I'm going to paint my sign with two coats of paint just to make sure that it covers very well. And I'm going to be using my Reveille shock paint in white color. Once the paint is dry, I will use a roller and with a black marker, I will draw lines to create a ship black look. I did not want the lines to be so marked in my sign, so I used the same brush that I used to paint the white and I'm going to run it over the lines just to make sure that they look a little bit lighter. And you can also use a little bit of a gray paint and you can paint that over the white color just to give the sign more dimension. Once the paint is dry, you can use Dollar Tree stickers if you have. You can write it by hand with any marker or paint or you can use your Cricut and create a decal with some black vinyl that says bath or whatever that you want to put on your sign and then just stick it in the center. It is super easy to make and it's going to look beautiful. Another super simple and easy DIY that you can make is use one of these Barbie toilets that you can get in the Dollar Tree toy section and then you can paint it. I'm going to be using my black ultra matte spray paint and it's going to look super beautiful. Um, it looks with more quality and it really match with the core theme that I have in mind. So this is going to be the result of both projects and they turned out so cute and super easy and budget friendly to make. For the second project, I'm going to be using these two pieces of wood that I just had. Um, they are 4 by 5 inches and they both have a hole in the top center of the wood. Um, and I decided to use them to make two small signs. So I used my Cricut um, to make two decals with the woman and man bathroom icons. Um, and I'm going to stick the decal on each piece of the wood. If you don't have a Cricut, it's okay. You can print any image from the internet. You can cut it out and you can draw the shape on the wood or you can draw the shape on any contact paper, then cut it and put it on your wood surface.
From there, I'm going to use my Rivoli shock paint in black color and I'm going to paint my two signs completely. And as always, to dry the paint faster and to be able to paint the back part of the signs, um, just to make the process faster and easier, I always like to use my heat tool. Um, and in the description box, I'm going to be leaving you the link of where you can get this tool. From there, you can remove the decals of the signs and then you're going to see that silhouette on the wood um, with the color and natural texture that the wood has. And I really love how it looks. I also want that the wood texture just pop out a little bit more on the edges of the sign. So I decided to use a sandpaper or a sanding sponge and I'm going to be sanding the edges just a little bit to make sure that I get that effect. Finally guys, I put a piece of youth cord in the holes that each of my signs had and I made a small knot. Guys, you can make this project of any junk piece of wood that you have at home like I did and turn it into a beautiful and rustic sign for your bathroom. The next project is going to be super simple. Um, you're going to need one of these Barbie bath tops um, that you can get in the Dollar Tree toy section too. And then I'm just going to paint it and let it dry very well. And then I put this Walmart boxwood inside the top and voila, this is going to be the result. I love to give green touches to my decor pieces using greenery or succulents. And I think this project turned out so nice. For the last project, I really want to show you how I transform this beautiful solid wood shop that I bought like a year ago in a thrift store for less than $2. Amazing, right? Um, I decided to paint all the edges and sides of the shop to be able to cover the designs that it had. And for the parts that I didn't want to be paint, I used some blue tape or any tape that you have at home and just cover them. The paint that I'm going to be using is going to be my Rivoli shock paint in ink or black color and I have to give it a single coat of paint to cover everything very well and that it's something that I really love about the shock paint is that it's not necessary to sand or prepare the surface before painting it um, and besides that it dries very very fast. Once the paint is dry, I remove the tapes that I had placed on the parts that I didn't want to be painted. 
finally I placed this shelf on the wall of my bathroom and I put all the decorations that I made in this video and this will be the result of all our projects and I love how they look all the decor pieces turn out amazing and with a really high end looking and they are super easy to make extremely cheap and I love it um, if you like this video please give me a big thumbs up that really helps to support my channel I hope that you like and enjoy today's video and let me know in the comments which project was your favorite make sure that you are subscribed to my channel and that you share this video and this inspiration and these ideas with friends and family and guys remember to follow me on my social media pages I have Instagram Facebook Pinterest and my webpage DIYbyJazz.com see you on my next video bye guys